The new 100 km per hour speed limit should come into effect tomorrow. While the president has assented to the Motor Vehicles and Road Traffic Act, which allows for an increase in the speed limit, the law cannot be enforced until the legal notice is published in the Gazette. That publication is expected to take place tomorrow, thereby allowing law enforcement to execute their duties. The Ministry of Works and Transport has commenced the process of installing the necessary signage to inform motorists of the impending changes. Rishi Harinanan has the details of what can be expected. If you're driving along the highway, you will now see this sign. And no, it's not an error. The speed limit has gone up by 20 km per hour to 100 km per hour. And that's not all. There were other adjustments to the Motor Vehicles and Road Traffic Act. The speed for private motor vehicles increased from 65 to 100 km per hour outside a built-up area, but remains 50 km per hour in areas that have been built up. The speed for goods vehicles, the licensed MGW of which does not exceed 3200 kg without a trailer, is now 100 km per hour outside of a built-up area, and 50 km per hour in areas that have been built up. Commenting on this was Arrival Live's President Sharon Inglefield. She said she is not against the increase in the speed limit, but the group will continue to lobby for more educated and trained drivers through a transparent licensing system. Attention is needed on some of the roads with regard to marking, for instance, the Digger Martin Highway. Um, barriers are down there. We really need to focus on maintaining and fixing those barriers and those markings. Lighting, very important, and Tian Tech is out there ensuring that our roads and our highways are properly lit at night. There are several dark spots on our highways. Ms. Inglefield said the road infrastructure must be managed. Additionally, the speed spot cameras and red light cameras can be installed at any time with the passage of the Motor Vehicles and Road Traffic Act. However, Ms. Inglefield said this isn't expected to come on stream until sometime next year. Um, but that new motor vehicle road traffic act includes that penalty point system and the merit point system and that won't happen until next year so we need to make, ensure that our police officers understand the responsibility they now have to be on the roads on the highways on the main roads police need to be out there with all of their speed guns now that the risk have increased with new speed limits the Motor Vehicles and Road Traffic Act was assented to by the President on December 12th. Rishi Harinanan, Seniors.